Alright dudes, so you wanna install Linux Nessus vulnerability scanner on your Linux box, hey? Okay. You will need this. First. Okay, very good. Get all that. Now let's do sudo update rc to d nessus d of course d faults ah. okay it's a good sign so let's do forward slash etc and it initial dot d nessus Now, I want you to type in sudo nessus dash add user. Then you're going to add your name. Now, this is the important part. Just go ahead and use the default, press enter. Now, your password. Okay, now you fully configured your Nessus, made a user so you can not only open Nessus, but now log in the server and test nodes of vulnerabilities remotely if you so desire. Now, let's go ahead and use Nessus to log into our server. If we get this certificate that pops up, it's something like an SSL certificate SSH but it's more of a key identifier um, anyways just go ahead and click yes you're gonna need that in order to man in the middle with the server of Nessus and actually get good results okay so everything's loaded make sure all your plugins over here are loaded I mean you might not want all of them loaded but that's the way I like to do it Credentials, if you can get an SMB account, that'd be cool because you could make your penetration testing a lot quicker and easier, more root level, if you will, uh, quicker. Sprinkle. I leave all this alone unless you need to do some of this good stuff right here. Um, there's a lot more ports, so let's put this. Just to be safe, 6400, a couple more. Okay, now if you really wanted to, you could exclude a couple of things from the port scans. Well, I just want to go ahead and enable all so I can see all the goodies, if you will. Okay, target. So, I am connected to home network, home family. So, I need to port scan that actual network see what's going on 
Now I'm just gonna do this a quick way so you don't have to see all the ports that are open, just the hosts that are alive, which is good for pen testing. Oh, 10 amps, that'd be cool. Oh, looks like I got disconnected. That was cool, never tried that one. Anyway, let's try it again. Uh, don't use SP, use SS. Hope it'll connect. <coughs> Okay, we're connected back, so we're good. Port scan. That wasn't supposed to pop up. I accidentally clicked explore. Okay, we got some computers, got some ports. Whoop, whoop. Okay. So, I am... 106 obviously using a certain type of address now let's see let's try to hack something other than my IP let's try to get this one let's see what happens That seems to be my Windows box that I pretty much made hack proof. Nothing's really hack proof, but most script kiddies it is, and that's why I can't get through it with Nessus. Which Nessus is by no means at all a script kiddie program. It just uh, it does automate things, but that that does not make it anything difficult to work with. Okay, we're not getting anything from Nessus. So, I'm going to fire up a box that I know is vulnerable in many ways. And I'll show you the report. That will be in my next.